Who needs caffeinated soda when you got Catalyst Mints? So today I'm going to be talking to you guys about the Catalyst Mints. I have yet to try them. Aviators had them and they work for anything. You don't have to do gaming. And yes, I'm the only YouTuber you know that works at Chick-fil-A. Thank you very much. Come and eat my chicken. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, before we say anything else, the serving size, I already looked this up, serving size is two uh, per serving size. I don't know like the, how long you should wait, but I've taken like a total of three uh, periodically through the day. Uh, I feel wide awake, and it's like 8 o'clock at, at night, and I've been working all day. Like literally like So, wait, so you hours. took the serving size I at took, once or throughout the day? Th I, I didn't take the serving size at all. I took three, and it's periodically. so like one every two hours or something like that. They work. Um, usually it's about two, three, I say about ten minutes. Uh, you can actually hit, uh, feel it. If you're pregnant, if you are really sensitive to caffeine, and if you're a child, uh, it's not recommended that you do it. Probably, it's, you shouldn't do it. But uh, we don't, we we don't, we don't think you guys should try it because on the back of the label, right here, let me see that real quick. On the back of the label, it says it right, Chonder. There, it says not recommended for children, pregnant women, and people sensitive to caffeine. So we really don't recommend it. Uh, just for the safety of you guys, uh, it is very, very high caffeine for a mint. So, uh, I tried them. The flavor is Siberian Wintergreen. Uh, it's like a berry mint. Back it up a little bit. It's like a, it's like a, a, a fruity mint type of thing. Well, well, here's the kicker, though. The opening, it smells like Copenhagen. Yeah, that's, <laughs> that's, that's the difference. So, uh, I guess we're just going to go ahead and... I, you go ahead and try it for yourself. I haven't, I haven't had one yet. So what should I do? Suck on it or chew it up? Uh, I've, I just sucked on it. <laughs> okay. Uh, chewing wise, I wouldn't. I don't know about that because you don't get all the flavors. You know what I mean? All like you can kind of like gather in. So one. Uh yeah, just take one because those are thirty milligrams. And of I gotta get some sleep tonight because I got I got work at eight a.m. Yeah, so uh, you go ahead and try one of them. That is actually a really nice flavor. You taste the winter green. It's like a minty fruit. It's like a fruity mint. You know what I mean? When they get, when they get past all the winter green stuff, it's already on your damn tongue and your roof of your mouth. You can kind, kind of, of a, kind of feel a caffeine hit you. I don't know if you guys have ever had um. There's this packet of gum you can get uh, gum you can get at the um, like a CBS or Walgreens. It's in the yellow package. It's like a fruit flavored gum, and they're little tiny square pieces like this, like yellow, orange, green, and pink. God, that's what that tastes like. Well, it tastes like that stuff you get out of um, um, pinata, you know, pinata candy. It's like these little plastic things, they got little like nerds. fruits, like yeah. the, the fruits. Yes. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. Like, it's like candy shaped like fruit that tastes like the fruit that you're eating from the candy. Oh, uh, one more thing, uh, we'd like to say thanks, Catalyst, for that little sticker back there. If you can see it here, go ahead and zoom right in right there. Just get that closer. You just want us to say thanks for that. It's a little cool sticker that we got. Focus that a little, a little bit. It came with the uh, mints with it, so uh, I thought it was pretty cool since we were sponsored by them and everything. Uh, we really, really are grateful for the uh, sticker that you uh, provided us uh, that's our webs their website with our account on there uh link will be in there uh yeah if you can't you really really can't read that if you can't read that which i'm sure you can't read that it'll be in the description below as well as our other sponsors but we're not talking about everybody else we're talking about catalyst because catalyst is uh well i think I'm gonna, I'm gonna have one tomorrow morning for work yeah, I think uh, the total on these three right here, let me have that camera back. Uh, the total on these three right here is just focus on these real quick. Um, I got this for about $25 of shipping and handling for three of them. They, I, they are pretty expensive for mints. I think one container is probably around $10. You want to go ahead and check it out real quick. Uh, but uh, I got three of these. The more you buy, it saves you more. Um, you can't buy a single mint. Oh, yes, you can. You, you can't. can buy one ten of mint equals seven energy drinks. Uh, that's, that, I'd say it's probably around $10. $10. Yeah, it's $10. Uh, shipping and handling is probably going to be around $15 for that. Uh, I would recommend getting the three or more. I would recommend getting, was that like six? But there's a six ten. And six. then if you're a big spender, and these things actually work for whatever the hell you need, 
you can go to Siberian Wintergreen. 175 inner drinks worth 25 tens. 100, I'm pretty much you'll be paying, I'd say $175 after shipping and handling. And uh, if you're out of the country, you'd be paying almost 200 to get this. But it's worth it. Uh, me personally, uh, uh, what would you give the rating out of the review, out of the flavor, and I guess the really the first hit of uh, mint that you get? What well, would you give the review out of? My biggest thing was I was afraid it was going to taste like Monster Energy. I hate that taste. And um, personally, my heart cannot handle energy drink like fake ass like Red Bull. So it's going to give you real energy. It's ginseng. Caffeine, or like an ass load of unhealthy amount of caffeine, and sugar, and a lot of sugar, and that's where you get that all combined, and that's why people die when you overload. And I'm sure you, you there yeah. should be some issues with these, yeah, but, but don't abuse them. Yeah, don't abuse it. We want, we want if you do buy these mints, please eat them responsibly. The last thing we want is anybody getting any like injured or sick or anything like that. Uh, these are for what they are. They are really good mints to periodically take. Take them periodically. It's like kind of like prescription pills or anything like that. Just be careful when you eat them. Two per serving size. Um, so don't just go and like chug the whole thing in one sitting because uh, that's seven energy drinks. You just eight. So that's really, I, it's really not wise. I feel like I. Um, I feel like I just got kicked in the head by a donkey. <laughs> um, I'm a fucking liar. Wow. <laughs> Let's see if my see if you can tolerate it a little bit better. But uh, when I was using it, it did help out a lot. Uh, working really late shift, around like twelve hours a day. Uh, use it. I didn't eat one near the end of the day, but I did take them periodically, and it did give me enough energy. Still wide awake to make a video. Perfectly fine. I am a little exhausted, but I'm not tired. That I guess it can be a little different. But been on your feet doing hard ass work. For 12 hours. Yeah. Compared to me flipping chicken. But uh, if you do use them as a uh, work ethic, I would not recommend these working out. But work-wise, uh, I would just take one in the morning and then, like, I guess, like, one after lunch. Other than that, you should be fine. Um, really, I, I, out of the product I've seen today, I give it about 8 out of 10. There, there is some things. That it, can, it can add some more kick into the flavor. But other than that, I think that's really about it. Uh, other than that, the product's really good. I give it a... The energy's there. They held up to their word. There just needs to be, personally, my personal flavor choice. I think there needs to be other flavors. And I'm sure you guys are working on that. I know Catalyst, we're going to link you this. And I know you guys will watch it. And I hope you do enjoy it. But this is our honest opinion. But I personally feel like the Siberian Wintergreen needs more wintergreen flavored That's... added to it. Not, the sh not sugar flavored, natural flavored wintergreen. I would prefer that added to that. Or having a separate one where it's like wintergreen other than being Siberian. That's what I gave it to my coworkers. I gave it to two of them. They said they... They're expecting it to be a little bit more stronger than what it was in the mint section, but they said it'll taste a little fruity. I thought it tasted a little fruity. Did you taste that? There's a little fruity kick to it, but you can also taste the wintergreen in it. Uh, that's why I give it an 8 out of 10. Uh, the aftertaste is great, but yeah, it's just the flavors, and I'm hoping, this is me personally, I would, wouldn't mind seeing a cinnamon flavored. If you guys know what I'm talking about, I'm talking about like you guys have had big red chewing gum, that type of cinnamon. Like Jolly Rancher cinnamons and everything like yeah. that. Yeah. So, something along the lines of that. That would be so, um, awesome. So what, what do you guys want to see in this product if you already tried? If not, try some. The link will be in the description for you to buy. We prefer if you get the three pack because it, it does save you a lot other than the one. And it's not too expensive like the six pack. But the more you buy in the one setting will save you a lot more money. But we prefer the three out of anything else because it gives you just enough that you need for a little bit, but not expensive for one. So that's what we expect. So what do you guys want to see in flavors? If you haven't tried it, go try it out today. The link will be in the description. If you can buy it, make sure you do it from us. And it uh, helps us out a lot. You got anything to say? Uh, no, sure. But we'll be, be sure, again, responsibility and everything with these. What not to do with them is pretty obvious. This is it shows you the ingredients. So if you have any allergies, please read the ingredients. And I'm pretty sure it's on their website. Let's find out. What is? Yeah, they got all these, uh, all this 
facts and stuff like that. 30 uh, milligrams of caffeine in each mint, along with our proprietary formula of terrine. Not too bad. It's got some vitamins. Siberian. There is no calories and no sugar in this, so that's why I thought that was actually pretty cool. There's no sugar in it. That's why. Really, that's what I think is cool about it, since there is no sugar. It's mainly no, just caffeine. Yeah, it is an energy. It is an energy gaming mint. So if you do game with it, don't get crazy with it. So uh, that does it for this video. Uh, Wix gave his opinion. I gave mine. I thought it was a really good product for a mint. But like I said, if you guys want to go buy some, buy the three set because it's not too much. But you also have some later on. So if like. You can use uh, one ten a week. Uh, by the way, all the stuff's made in the U.S. Ten to the mint. Everything's made in the U.S. So um, that's also another reason why I like that. And uh, I guess that does it for this video, guys. So uh, like I said, what do you guys want to see in the flavors? And uh, if you haven't tried any, go try some if you want to. The link will be in the description. There will be a future video comparing between gaming energy. Now, Catalyst, I love you guys. But... I've never had G Fuel before, and I'm not going to say it's good, I'm not going to say it's bad, we won't know, but I want to do a comparison video in the future to see which one is better. And obviously, G Fuel is loaded with sugar, I already know that, but we always, you know, it's all about the energy. It's all about that science, it gives us the kick, but without running this video any longer than it has to be, thank you guys for the work you put into these mints, and we do appreciate them, I hope to see some... Great products in the future. All right, guys, that's it for this video. If you like to hit that like button, share this to show your friends about this product of theirs. Uh, follow us on Twitter, Facebook, and everything else in between that. Subscribe for more videos. Hit that bell so when we do have a video or go live, it does tell you guys. And um, like I said, tell us in the comments what you guys think should be a flavor or anything like that. And as always, I'll see you.